All right, you know it's that time when things are growing in the yard. I rolled around in the dandelions two weeks ago as the debate raged on cut them or let them grow. Well, growing right now is something called dog vomit mold. There was no way I was going to roll around in it, but I wanted to tell you about it in case you see it. Do you know what this is? It's one of um, about 800 different slime molds. Jeff Fowler says this one is called dog vomit. It has another name too, scrambled eggs. Slime molds are some of the most unattractive funguses and molds, and they can be found in many places. The clever nicknames are just accurate descriptions of what these look like, but here's what's happening. They're funguses that start below the ground, they work their way to the top, and then in cool, wet conditions, they spring out above the earth. The slime molds come in different shapes and sizes. They feed on old organic matter. Jeff Fowler says it's not just a spring phenomenon. We'll see them throughout the year, different, you know, different shapes, different sizes, different colors, um, different slime molds. Fowler is interested to see them this spring and summer because we didn't have a harsh winter, which would normally kill some fungus spores. The slime molds are safe. Look at them. You don't have to touch them. Just let them run their natural course. Some of the slime molds actually only um, show their 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 faces um, for about an hour and then they just go away. So um, they're interesting, interesting slime molds for sure. Yeah. Hey, chemicals don't work on them, but you can take a rake and break them apart. In some countries, people eat these slime molds. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.